This is a complex of buildings that are very different. The Hamilton building is very exuberant in the way that it has lots of angles and projects out over the street. The Ponte building is very uh, strong and statuesque. The new building that we did to, to tie it all together allows both of those other buildings to be themselves. Design is about process. There's a whole series of decisions that a designer, that an architect, are making to create what you're seeing. The architecture and design galleries are part of a sort of larger renovation of the historic Gio Ponte building. And the, the new design galleries is a really sort of unique opportunity to rethink the presentation and interpretation of design at the Denver Art Museum and within a, a rich architectural context. So whenever we start the design process for really any kind of design, we do a lot of research. So when we first started looking at the architecture design galleries and the design studio and the Ponte building, we actually started by looking at the history of Ponte and his own uh, projects around the world, anything from lamps to also hotels and buildings and the facades of buildings that he had done. And we took a lot of cues from the kind of compositional techniques that he used in his own design to then use in the design concept so we continue to develop. Exhibition design is a balance between how to communicate each object or each artwork easily to the audience uh, as well as let them feel immersed into the artwork or objects. Thanks to great architecture, great collection, great curation, I think we are conceiving something that has a balance of communication design and environmental design. Working on the architecture and design galleries in this new revitalized Martin building has been such a great opportunity to be able to come in and uh, create these spaces, particularly where we didn't have galleries for the architecture and design collection before. So this really is a unique opportunity to be able to uh, think about all these many 18,000 plus objects in our collection and which ones are we going to pull out and how are we going to engage visitors with that. Given that it is the architecture design galleries, I hope that the visitor walks away understanding a little bit more about the process behind design uh, through the objects that are on display, through the way that they've been showcased, and understands that um, there's a, a process and a design theory and design thinking behind almost every single object so that they can then utilize that kind of thinking and apply it to their own daily lives as well.